Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. In today's video, you will learn how to create an icon mobile menu or you can say an F like menu and wall face using free Elementor. And this is one of the most demanding features of wall face. The icon mobile menu lets you design and create page navigation or header and footer menu bar with mobile responsive icons and help it resemble the design that you see in desktop view. And these are some demos available. So after watching this video, you can have a menu like this. Obviously, you can use your own icons, text and links. This is another example. You can see home settings menu gallery. Then another example. And then these. So let's see how we can create such menus in our workspace using free Elementor. And to create such menus, we will be using Element Fact plugin. This plugin also has lots of cool features available for Elementor. Some are free and some are free. And I have couple of videos about this plugin already. And to download this plugin, just follow the first link in the description. And then click on download free. This will take you to Wordfish repository from where you can download this plugin. You will get a zip file like this. Now you can just upload this to your Wordfish. Let's go to our Wordfish. So this is the website that we will be using. I'll go to its dashboard. And to upload the plugin, we'll go to plugins, add new. And upload plugin, choose file. And we'll select the plugin, open and install now. And after installation, you can go ahead and activate it. And this will take you to its dashboard where you can explore core widgets, third party widgets, extensions, API settings, and other settings. And just go to core widgets and here search for icon menu. And you can see icon mobile menu. Make sure to enable it and then click save settings and that's it now you can use this everywhere on your website and you can also create header and footer and you can use it over there let's edit any page with elementor i'll go to pages and let's edit home page with elementor and as i said you can use that menu everywhere on this page okay so i'll scroll down and let's use it over here so let's search for that menu and you can see i can mobile menu just drag it over here and instantly you will get a look like this home cart account and these are the items home cart account you can add further links if you want to and this is style one you can change it over here to style two three and four you can notice these small changes okay but we can change the colors and fonts based on our need let's go to style two now to make changes to any item, you can go ahead and open it and then change the title. Home is fine and you can change its link. So this will be linked to the home page. You can change the icon over here. For now, let's keep it and we will change the cart to a boat. So we'll just click on it. We'll use another icon from here. And let's use this one. We will call this contact and we'll link this to contact page. Okay, same goes for this one. You can change the icon, text, and link. And to add another one, you can just duplicate it and then change the icon. Let's say YouTube and we will call this YouTube. Okay. And in this way you can add another item now let's make changes to the style so we'll go to style tab and here you can change the background of this menu which will affect the whole background okay like this and then you can scroll down you can add border radius to it padding margin these are spacing okay you can notice the changes the default values will be fine if you want you can change them and then you can go to menu icon where you can make changes to the style of this icon let's change the color of the icon to white and this is the icon size okay so let's increase it then you can give it border radius and background if you want to if i click here i can give it another background and let's change back the icon color okay let's give this some border radius of about 20 and the padding will also be 20 Let's make it 10 
make this 50 okay so in this way you can make changes to the icon then scroll down same goes for the menu text you can change its background and its color and then the border radius padding margin this is the typography where you can change the font family size and transform and so on and to show you quickly let's use this one and that's it so in this way you can design a menu and then you can display it on desktop or only on mobile and tablet if you want to hide it for desktop you can just edit this container then go to advanced scroll down and go to responsiveness so you can hide it on desktop by enabling this option now if i switch to mobile and this will be visible okay by the way you can change the icon size for mobile as well menu icon size will be 18 and menu text okay this is our menu now let's publish the page review it the menu will not be visible on desktop because we have hidden it and if i switch to mobile view the menu is now visible one more thing is if you want to make this sticky at the bottom you can use another plugin called royal elementor add-ons so you can just follow this link in the description it will take to royal elementor add-ons from here you can download and install this plugin i am already using it okay you can see royal add-ons and this is also a very powerful plugin you can use it for different purposes okay that you can see over here let's go back to our elementor page and if you want to make this container sticky at the bottom just edit the container from here then go to advanced and here you can see sticky section from royal add-ons open it and then enable this option so enable on which device on desktop or on mobile so we will choose mobile and tablet and as we are not using this menu on desktop so we can remove this and then you can choose the position type to be sticky and scroll or fixed by default so if you enable this option and then you can change the location to bottom now this will be sticky at the bottom okay let's publish it preview this page again now you can see the menu is sticky at the bottom obviously the design is not looking good but we can change it okay so let's go back let's edit our menu let's remove this background and uh, we will give this section another background now let's remove these borders as well so we will edit the menu and under menu items we will remove the border publish let's check again and this is our menu if you want to remove this overriding you can just give this some z index so go back to this container advanced and under z index make this 99 or something publish let's check again and that's it so in this way you can create an icon mobile menu or you can say an app like menu using free elementor and again both the links are in the description you can get both the plugins for free and to learn more just follow my channel still if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next